let me tell you something. In this video, I'll guide you through the process of creating AI generated video from any video that you have. Let me show you. A website called Caper. Hope I'm pronouncing it right. By the way, I'm not sponsored by it or anything like that. Here's a website. Um, here's you have three options here. Um, one of them is obviously, as I say, it's, it's self-explanatory. Uh, one of them is flipbook. This one will have more like a frame by frame uh, image. And uh, the motion, obviously, it's more as, as you can see, it's smoother. I mean, like I said, it's, it's self-explanatory, but you know, just in case. And that for the last one, it's a full video. Um, only on the last uh, transform. This is the only one that you can uh, use exi existing video, but these two you'll have to use only an image. You will not be able to upload it in uh, a video. I can give you an idea on how to use that as well, like for videos as a transition. Uh, we'll get to, we'll get to that point later. Uh, so let's just try the uh, flipbook, right? I'll just, I'm just going to upload an image. I'm going to use this um, Porsche steering wheel. This is the Porsche 911 GT3 RS sick car anyways that's not the subject i have a full video of it if you want to see it all right so let's say so here is where you get creative let's just say uh you don't feel like being extra creative uh you can just click here it will out of uh prompt for you it was going to read the image and it's going to say steering wheel see close up for steering wheel nice here you have all the options again and style of you can also be creative you can also go to um, for example chat gbt and then ask it to be creative for you and you can do that uh, but for testing purposes only i really like the oil painting so as you can see uh in style of and then an oil painting 196 uh in the 1600s and then you know and then obviously you can change anything that you don't like here uh whatever error you can add um so for just for testing i'll keep it how it is video settings here you can set it for how long you want it for an image you can only have six seconds uh, and here how much of ai ish you want it to look like so let's just make it six for example <laughs> and um okay so and it's pretty cheap on how much it would cost only six credit so let's just say generate preview for this this is sick this is really nice. It kind of made it look like an old Mercedes inside. I'm not going to lie. Don't you think? Look, look at this. So let's just say that we're going to use this video, right? We're going to, you want to generate a video out of this image. It's cool. If you can use this as transition, for example, like at the end of a video. Okay. So yeah, and then I'll download it and then I'll have a video. See, it doesn't take that much credit too. That's not bad. All right. On to the next one. Now let's go to uh, the motion. Again, it's going to make it smoother. Also an image. Let's try the same exact image. Sunset, uh, sunset Desert. Huh? Oh, well. All right. And let's just see. Let's just do I like this. Okay. Generate. Um, eight seconds. It's enough. Um, oh, 32 credits. See, it takes more credit for this one. All right. Motion. Let's make it six. Okay. All right. Let's check out the scenes that we have. Ooh, but look, this is sick actually. This is, you can make this as a really nice transition as well. Like you're inside of the car and then you're trying to transition into a desert. How sick is that? Come on, honestly. You know what, I'm gonna do this actually for my next trip for any anywhere that has desert scene. And I really like this idea. All right, and there you go. You see that? That's actually cool. But you see it's smoother than the other one. See? Yep, download. I need this. For the next one, let's do um, the transform. Now for this one, it's, like I said, it's better because you can actually upload a video. Now with the, it's going to take really long. So um, I'll show you the video that I uploaded. Here I have a video that's um, 20 seconds. Okay. Yeah. Right, I already made uh, those transitions in uh, Adobe After Effects. So now let's say I want to make this video right. If I do the prompt, now for this, for that one, see, 
this is sick a close-up of a porsche uh, emblem uh on a white car it's not a white car but it's okay and then here i did um oil paint here's what's, what's nice about this website as well it, if you go after you download your video if you right click on it and go to info it will tell you exactly what was your prompt so it can save you you know like in case you want to redo it again so like i said this will take a long time to do it here's the final video made it look like a curtain that's sick that is really nice now here's what you can do like that is a bit boring right what we can do is you can mix them together and you'll end up with something like this see this is the final video you see what i mean see, and then no back to normal everyone can be different with their creativity me and you can put the same thing and we still get the different results which is that's what's nice so we will both have our own touch in, in the video get creative be creative always um use ai for your transitions it's very creative to do transitions using ai so a video that you have like a two second video or three second video upload it here and make it look uh change it to an AI, uh, have it generate an ai version of it uh, with your own prompt and then use that on, you know as a transition to the other video you know what i mean so yeah leave a comment if you want to see more videos of that or if you want to see a video on how to create those transitions if you found this video helpful please subscribe and have a good day subscribe come on come on now